is going to be a back to school makeup tutorial and it is a very easy and dewy and fresh makeup tutorial something that you can do every morning and the school time very everyday look very natural and if you guys want to know how to achieve this look then go ahead and keep on watching all right i'm just going to prime my face using max prep and prime fix plus and i know my nails are not cute so we're just going to ignore that okay next product i'm going to be using is max prep and prime highlighting pen and bright forecast and i'm going to put this product on the, both of the under of my eyes and also on my nose and on my forehead and any other imperfections so this also works as a concealer as well so that's why you can also use as a concealer to cover up all your imperfections or dark circles but in my case i do that and also i use it to highlight my skin and give my skin a more of a dewy look ain't even there because i have hella feelings for you so yes, this is a foundation brush from Morphe, but it does do the job, so I'm taking this S1 foundation brush from Morphe, as I just said, and I'm using this to blend out the highlighting pen all over my skin. And just to let you guys know, this highlighting pen from MAC, it is a light to medium coverage, but it is for really everyday use, and I use this all the time because it works really well in covering your imperfections and giving your skin still a dewy, light look without making it look too cakey or anything and I love this stuff so much and I really recommend it to everybody. It all, all, all. I'm taking MAC's Mineralized Skin Finish Powder in Medium Dark and Morphe's Powder Brush and this doesn't have a name or a number or anything because it came in a set. So basically I am just putting this all over my face wherever I put the highlighting pen because it made me looking kind of pale. Next, I'm going to be taking the NYX Duo Chromatic Illuminating Powder in Synthetica and using that same brush, I'm just taking this product and applying it all over my face to give myself that natural, dewy, illuminating glow. And this is what that powder does and it is amazing. I love this stuff so much. It gives you that natural glow without overpowering that highlight and making you look like a disco ball. So I really, really love this product. So the blush I'm using is the Too Faced Papa Don't Peach Blush and the brush I'm using is the Real Techniques blush brush and I love this brush so much because it's so soft so I'm just applying that on my cheekbones and just working my way upwards so it won't have a harsh blend and a harsh line yeah, I'm going to be taking MAC's Mineralized Skin Finish Highlighting Powder in Soft and Gentle and Morphe's Fan Brush that again came in a set, but I'm going to be highlighting the tops of my cheekbones and the bridge of my nose and my nose to give myself a more of a highlighted, dewy, and fresh look. Maybe too good for so for brows, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Dip Brow in Dark Brown in a Morphe Angled Brush. It also came in a set, so there is no name for it. So for brows, basically I start off at the tail, and at the tail there's a lot more products. So I work my way from the tail all the way up to the front, and I kind of outline my hairs if that makes sense so it'll have an ombre effect and it'll look very feathery and natural so you can kind of see that i start off from the tail and i also recognize my arch and not emphasizing the arch but also outlining the arch as well and keeping my natural shape because I really love the natural brow look. Also, what you have to do is brush out your eyebrows after so it doesn't look very, very colored in. So for eyes, we're going to keep it really, really simple and basic because that's what we're going for here. So I'm taking the Naked Ultimate Basics palette and I'm going to be using the shade Faith. And I'm also going to be using a Morphe Fluffy Crease Brush that again does not have a name because it came in a set. So basically, I'm working my way from my outer corner all the way into my crease and just fluffing that in. Using the same palette and the same brush, I'm taking the shade Blow and just using that to highlight my brow bone. I'm using the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in Blackest Black and basically I'm just putting it on both of my eyes on both the top and the bottom of my lashes just to top it all off. Yeah, like they ain't even there. Alright, this is totally optional and if you have more time, so I'm taking a smaller brush from Morphe and using that same color that we use in our brow bone, I'm just going to put that in my inner corners. To top it all off, I'm just going to be using the Max Fix Plus Setting Spray and we are finished.
Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you like this video. Comment down below. Have a nice day.